was impressive. Yeah, great, good. Nice save, pal. Uh -huh. They're still shoving long. Whistle's gone here. Somebody wants to go. Jesus won the draw, and the puck departs the zone. And he comes up with it. Martin's moving the puck through his own zone. Moves it to Cheese. Puck scooped up by Oates. Directed over to Gritty. Not able to connect. Musa quickly over to Fisher. Pad save, and he made it look easy. Great job there. Martin's got a hold of the puck behind the net. From his own end, he moves it up ahead. Throws it in. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Here's a chance. Makes the save as he got a blocker on it. The icebreakers have it against the wall. On the heels of their blades, trying to get it out. And we've got a two-on-one. Stopped by the goaltender. Goalies are always trying to get better at this. Making the save, but getting the rebound into the corner. Past the midway mark of the frame. Still looking for our first goal. Cheese has won a big draw on their own end. Oh, what a stop! Harambe's locked in. Every puck hits him and stays in front of him. On the odd chance there's a rebound, he tracks that well, too. The icebreakers gain possession along the wall. Puck picked up by Goodman. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Martin's got it in the defensive end. Takes the feed. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. Here's an opportunity to clear the zone. Gets it out of his own end. Sends it over to Oates. Nothing doing on that. The icebreakers gain control of it. Keeps hold of the puck. Aaron pass and the play's broken up. And less than a minute to go here in the middle frame. He clearly doesn't like that. What a steal in his own end. Martin's done everything here except pull the other guy's gloves off. Excellent stick work on the play. Takes the feed at the point. And as the second period comes to an end, what can you say? This has been all about the goalies tonight. Still scoreless. What's in store for the third period? Let's tune in to find out just moments away. The officials are set, the players are set, Ray Ferraro between the benches is set. I'm James Sabolski. let's go. It's been a tight affair to this point. Third period is now underway. The icebreakers gain control of the puck against the wall. Taken along the wall by Gritty. Here's a shot, gets a piece of it with the blocker. Here's a pass down low. And he slides it quickly to Gritty. Oates explores his options in the corner. It's in the back of the net, they score! The longer this went on, you started to get the feeling that there's not gonna be a lot of offense. Now maybe this creaks the door open. The 
Nighthawks persistence finally pays off here in the third. You start to wonder after a while, even with all the majority of possession that they've had, if all of a sudden they give up one chance and it goes in their net, that's when teams fall apart. Let's it fly! Scores! We well, just keep working away. Your lines roll over and over and over. You hope to build a little momentum. One shot ties the game. And now it's a whole new ball game. And we are really even up here. Lots of time left in this period. We are all tied up in this one. The Nighthawks win the faceoff. Martin's got it across the line. Now a quick pass to Oates. Referee's got his hand up, signaling a delayed penalty. And the official stops the play as somebody's off to the sin bin. The icebreakers have been handed two for interference. You can slow a player down, but it can't be that obvious. He gets involved in his lane of skating, and interference will be the call. From his own end, he picks up the puck. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. The centermen glide into position. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Strong defensive effort. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. They get it out of the defensive end. Slides the puck across to Mason. From the point, looks to make something happen. Move to the middle, lets it go. Denies him in front. Referee signals penalty coming up here with a delayed call. Whistle blown, stopping the play. Interference the call, can you argue this one? Well, you can argue anything, James, but that's fair. That's an interference penalty. Cheese has won the face off deep inside the offensive zone. The icebreakers have possession shorthanded. Puck moved back to center, forcing them to regroup. Slides it up to Mason. Here they come on the attack. Stays with it. Moves right to the middle. Oh, and he'll be shaking his head on that as they were so close. Pokes the puck away. The Nighthawks scoop it up along the boards. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. And the linesman calls icing on the play. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. The Nighthawks win the draw. Quick feed to Cheese. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Oates. Wide to the net. Got to get it on the net. I know he's trying to be perfect with it, but it's a scoring chance that seems all alone. Both sets. Is that one That's a big goal when they put him into the lead. Once he broke clear, he's got his head up, he reads the scene where the goalie is, and beats him with the shot. The icebreakers come up with a big goal here in the third. There's a difference between sitting back and protecting and trying to grow the lead. I always like the team that works to make a one-goal lead, too. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And he denied that opportunity. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. He scores! What an effort to get this game back to level. You've got to continue to work even when you trail in the game. They did that, and now they have a brand new game to play. I scored a ton of these goals. You work on deflecting the puck in practice, you get into good position, and you're able to get your stick on it. Tough for the goalie to follow. The Nighthawks have grabbed momentum on their side with a monstrous third period goal here. And now as we enter into the last half of this period, the game is squared. They don't have to chase it anymore. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Tries to the crease, and that goes wide. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is, oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. Penalty coming up as the whistle stops the play. And it looks like two minutes in the box for holding will be the call here. Well, he's got a mitt full of the guy's sweater. It's tough to argue That's that one. Save. Great balance as he scoops it back up. Couldn't catch up to that pass. 
slides the puck over to Fisher. Couldn't complete the play. Sends a pass over. Martin stick handling in his own zone. Behind the net, looking for the transition game. Moves the puck to Cheese. And now it's over to Mason. Unable to reach that one. Gets a hold of the puck here at his own end. Dishes it to Crosby. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. The Nighthawks have it in the offensive end. Let's it fly, and that one's stopped. Time's up for the power play. Both teams back to equal strength. Pretty hard to have a more low-intensity power play than that. It really didn't generate a thing, and when you don't generate much, you're sure not going to score. Here's an odd man rush. Hangs onto the puck. Long save. All oh, quick reflexes on the play. And now he moves it to Crosby. And there's the save. We'll get a face off, and some lucky fan gets a memory of a lifetime. Here in the back half of this period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Nice job tying up his opponent. Denies that opportunity. The Nighthawks move the puck in the defensive zone. And now he angles it across to Mason. The Nighthawks take it along the wall. Oh, making his presence felt with a hit. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. The Nighthawks win the face-off. Slides the puck over. The Icebreakers will play it in their own end. Too much congestion in front. The Nighthawks have it from their own end. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up Steve. Move to the middle, and that's blocked. Scores, and they go up by one. Time no more. That's a big goal to be able to take the lead. Really tough for the goalie to read where the heck this thing's going. I'm looking at the shot. I can't tell where it's going, but the backhander beats the goaltender. The Nighthawks have taken a critical one-goal lead here in the third. What's the strategy now? The strategy shouldn't change. You now accept you have a little bit of a cushion, and it's that one-goal lead. Denies him on the play. The Icebreakers get a hold of the puck along the boards. And he moves it up to Fisher. Let's it go with the stop. The Nighthawks gain possession in their own end. And now it's to Oates. With possession along the wall. Tees him up. Turns it aside with the save. Scooped up along the wall by Goodman. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. Moves the puck across to Oates. The Icebreakers have it against the wall. Puts it on net. Uh-uh. Nice block. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Grabbed along the board by Crosby. Here he is, shot right in front. Oh, just slide to the net. Doesn't miss by much, that's a good shot. Just outside of the key. On the redirect. The Nighthawks gain possession along the wall. Here's a sprint for the loose puck. And this one is all over as the final horn sounds. If you can control the puck, you control the pace of the game. And I thought that had a lot to do, James, with the way this turned out. They seemed to have the puck a lot. Did it also seem like the ice was maybe tilted in this one tonight? Well, if it is, then the engineer's got to fix it no. because you can't have an uneven ice. In the meantime and in between time, he's Ray. I'm James. Good night.